Oh, great life and more family. Um, I've had a lot going on lately. Don't worry. Nothing too bad, except there has been some more health issue things. But um, I have my garden well underway. And so I'm going to take you out here. And I'm going to show you the garden. It's kind of cute, actually. There's one of our tomato plants. I've got to fix this up because it kind of didn't get the memo that it's supposed to be in the middle there. And then I've got sweet basil and then over here I have crookneck yellow zucchini and I have green zucchini this and this are potatoes this is shallots this is cantaloupe and I started these onions in the house, but I gotta water everything tonight and I'm sure they will perk up. This is my rosemary bush. I've had it for years. This is the beets. This is a, another tomato plant really taken off there. And then this is a red bell pepper. That is sage, another tomato plant. Um, this is a yellow bell pepper, another tomato plant. Can you tell we love tomatoes here? Um, most of them are big tomatoes, but one of them, it's a cherry tomato. Uh, this is our Plabolano chili. And this is another color of the bell peppers. And this is another bell pepper and another bell pepper and we have Greek oregano and we have two pots waiting to welcome new plants and over here we have our mint over here we have our strawberries over here we have little watermelons and that's a cactus the pool in the background there the big one is the dog's pool. This pot and this pot are currently not actively growing anything. There's an aloe vera. And this is an orange kumquat. And over here, this is our Eureka lemon tree. And then we have flowers growing there. I want to get some nesters, some seeds, and start them. And these are all flowers. And then over here, this is the cucumbers. I got to tie them up pretty soon. And so that's about it for outdoors. But anyway, that's what I've been up to lately. I've got a birthday a week from Friday and, um, so I, I have a party June 1st, so I'm trying to get everything ready. But that's not really the reason that I'm cleaning so heavily. Tomorrow I start five weeks of infusion therapy. And if that doesn't work, then I will probably have to start getting blood transfusions for a while. Anyway... I will try to put up a new video again um, later this week. And if you're not already uh, subscribed, tap that subscribe button. It's free. Doesn't cost you anything to join. Um, I do have a Patreon account, but I um, need to figure out how to put that up. I had it up on one of my videos at one point, but um, I don't know. Things happen.
So I have to get the information for that, go into my Patreon account and all that, which won't be too hard. And the guy in the picture back there, that's my son, Will. He has a channel called Tilted Tilter Gaming. And my nephew has one called Equestrian Horse Fan or something like that. I'll have to double check that. But anyway, I wanted to share what was up and let you know that I am trying to post to keep you all in the loop. And I love you all. And also, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button because that lets YouTube know that you like my videos and then they will be more likely to share them on um, the main frame or whatever. I don't know how that works. I still have a ways to go. I, my goal was to get to 1,000 before my birthday. I'm at 244, which is, I'm not complaining. It'll get there when it gets there. But it would be nice to have any of you who are not subscribed join our family and I want you to know that you have a purpose you are unique you're an individual you're loved you're special you're smart no matter what anybody tells you and you are very very important there's a special reason why you're here it's not just because your parents decided to have a child. It's something deeper. And that makes you as unique as a fingerprint. I love you all and hope to get out the next video soon. I hope you're all doing well and getting ready for summer, and I will see you soon.